Hello and welcome to Minecraft Stacks on Sex, the challenge where I collect a double chest of every item in the game. I hope you are all having an amazing day. If you weren't here last time, let me recap. We collected a whole ton of glistening metal slices, enough to fill a nice double chest worth. Our item now? Bamboo fence. Weird one, I know, but the spinner knows what's best. If you enjoy this content and other gameplay content, make sure to subscribe. Hit the bell too so you never miss a single video. With all that out of the way, we began our conquest of Bamboo Fence. First thing I did on Bamboo Fence 1 was look at a lot of the stuff I did. I hadn't played this world since May, and just started it back up in July, so I missed it a lot. After reminiscing, I took down the fence where the old wall village was, covered it up too, didn't want a gaping hole in my walls. Showed oh, chat my so progress so far on Sex with Sex, showed them I changed the wheat texture too. I think it's funny or green. Went to a creative world to see if you could put stuff in an end chest with a hopper. You can't. Now I'm back on Sex and Sex, making a new plot where my mob farm is. Ran out of deep slate, so went to go get some. Finished the border, now for the insides, which I need a ton of dirt for, which is what this plot is for. By the way, when I say plot, it means 100 by 100 square. Here we go, can't wait for to do this for 20 days again. Got a bit done and lit some of that up. I'm kind of excited to see what I make of this. And you know what? Uh -huh. Yeah? Yeah, you know what? Idiot. Went out to the jungle right next to my desert village. What did it get bamboo fence oh, done it with soon? Why Before I continue though, I don't have a lot of durability on my sword. And it doesn't have mending. Went right for that as soon as I noticed. I forgot I had bamboo at the village here, so I farmed them while I was here. Got two mending books. One for my sword, the other one for my silk touch pickaxe. Now everything, except my bow, has mending. Then, of course, I was gonna repair my sword before I use it again. Since I had to wait a while, I got more of the new plot done. Used all of my dirt. Got my sword up till I was happy, then went right back to bamboo breaking. Broke some trees too for the sticks. And now I'm behind the bamboo farm. I wanna try something. This is a blast from the past. Do you remember what this was? My old melon farm. Just all destroyed and broken. Also found out where that hole was. Where my speedy crop farm is. It's where I got stoned for the first time. So you know how in a automatic farm, some of the farm stuff doesn't get knocked into the water? Well, I fixed that, kind of. I know I could use rails and hopper minecarts, but this way I, I use a lot less iron. Afterwards, I made as much bamboo fence as I could. And now begins the real progression of bamboo fence. Bits. Gotta shift the mob farm with single stacks for more storage. Then of course I did more bamboo breaking, which was used for more fence. And here we are, already the six of the- what the hell? Got tired of using my main sword, so I made a few and grabbed one for the storage. Did some more stick and bamboo getting. Made everything I got into bamboo fence. And here we are. Progress is going super well for bamboo fence. On bamboo fence 2, I started with some light XP farming. A lot of my stuff is dying. Or at least getting there. If I want to continue doing cool stuff with them, I need a good way to heal them. Went right to the ground as soon as I could. Just because it's about getting the item doesn't mean I can't get it fast. What is that, a llama? It's a weird looking llama. Oh, it's us automatically tamed. Can I kill you? What do you drop? <laughs> Nothing. Okay, what does this man have to say? Drop bamboo. Now I know what to do when I see um, pandas. Also got some sugar canes from my desert village because I didn't have any at home. Made a bit into rockets because I was running out of those. There you go. Then I did the very slow process of turning all those bamboo into bamboo fence. I have a tendency of wanting to show myself making progress, no matter how small. But look at that! A huge increase. Wow. I only need a row plus some left. Compared to how easy I can get them, that's not hard at all. So that's what I did, determined to finish bamboo fence. And again, took forever to make all the bamboo in defense. But here it is, bamboo fence complete. Didn't take that long either, which is good. The more things I can take out at a time, the easier it will be to take out more items in future updates. The stream didn't finish there, so to make the video a bit longer, I'd like to tell you how the rest of the video went. Of course it organized all my shulkers. Went right for the hill plot. I still need to finish it, but realized my shovel was dying. Then my house caught in fire, that was fun. Hmm, this place looks familiar. 
I thought the deep dark would be the best place to heal my items. Not only was it helpful, I unearthed some diamonds as well. I was able to heal everything. You can tell by how I'm at home right now. It's time to Let's see what the next item will be. Jungle trap door. Don't make fun of me, but I didn't have any jungle wood in storage. But thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to subscribe. I post no more gameplay videos every Saturday and sometimes sex on sex on Sundays, whenever I can. I love the series so much. And someday I'd love to branch out to other games. I've already had a couple ideas in my head now. But with that being said, thank you so much. And until next time, goodbye.